Hi, I'm Dave Levesey, one of your Fairfield County Commissioners. As part of a digital state of the county address today, we are virtually dedicating the new patriotic mural at the Amstutz building, formerly the home of Veteran Services, 227 East Main Street, Lancaster, Ohio, and the one-time home of Dr. Amstutz, a former longtime resident of Fairfield County and also a World War II veteran. The concept for the Hometown Heroes mural grew from the respect for our veterans and for those who have fallen in combat, especially those from Fairfield County. We are honored to have Ms. Terry Machonis, our employee at the Child Support Enforcement Agency and mother of the fallen Sergeant Joe Coletti involved with the efforts to create this tribute. We will always honor our veterans and those who have fallen for their service to our country. At its core, the mural is depicted in a style reminiscent of an antique advertisement found on the side of buildings throughout Fairfield County. Numerous patriotic elements and references to Fairfield County are carried throughout the mural clockwise and moving down each section facing the mural. Decorative bunting, identification of demographics of Fairfield County, V for veterans, victory, veterans, and valiant, space for the dedication of a plaque for the future, the Fairfield County seal visualized as a banner, names of the U.S. military branches in their proper order as guided by DOD. The American flag slightly larger than the Ohio flag and on the marching right. The Ohio flag, 15 gold stars to represent our two cities and 13 townships fully in the county. Honorary message, hometown heroes. A symbol from the U.S. coat of arms family members service flags, blue, serving in war, silver, injured in war, and gold, lost in war. The poppy flower, military memorial flower. U.S. military ID tags shadowed with the name of Sergeant Coletti. Veterans burial flag. We appreciate the hard work and multiple stakeholders who contributed to this project. And we have received a lot of positive feedback from the community about the mural for its message, educational approach, and attractive visual appeal. There are many people to work on the painting of the mural, and we appreciate all their hard work. The mural contributes to our culture in Fairfield County, and we appreciate Remo Remo Designs, LLC, and the many volunteers who worked hard on the mural from April of 2019 to August of 2020 when the mural received its top coat to protect it. The top coat was sealed on August 17th on the birthday of Sergeant Coletti. As we think about our hometown heroes, it is right to think about our first responders and law enforcement officers. We understand that they deeply appreciate the value of our community law enforcement officers, firefighters, emergency responders, and those who calmly and efficiently dispatch their critical response, whether routine or unimaginably horrific, thank you for your service. As we consider the importance of critical conversations about equality and justice for all, those who have been marginalized, we endorse open, honest communication and a desire to improve and empathize with one another. One of the most important questions we can ask ourselves is what have we done today to support or encourage one another? I'd like to tell you about uh, a personal experience I had back in the 1960s. I was actually in the military away from home and I befriended an African-American friend. His name was Tony. And Tony and I, um, and being from the small town of Lancaster, actually outside of town, I never really experienced racism. 
So Tony and I went to an adjoining town next to our army base and went into a uh, went into a establishment and was soon asked to leave. Uh, they made a, they made comments to us that I'm not going to repeat, but essentially it was because of my friend Tony's race and the fact that I was with him, they asked us to leave. And I was shocked by that experience and it's always stuck with me what happened within that short time. And for us to uh, say we, we know what racism is and, and uh, understand it, we don't. We don't have any idea what racism's like. Um, unless we're able to walk in someone else's shoes and obviously we're not able to do that. So I, I empathize with some of the issues that are going on and I hope here in Fairfield County we can move beyond that and we at uh, Fairfield County government will not tolerate any racism in any form. So thank you. Today reach out to someone who is struggling, lonely, overwhelmed or pressured by life, pick up the phone and give them some hope. Lend a listening ear, be a friend, show gratitude. Here in Fairfield County, we support one another. It is great to have a hometown where neighbors know one another and care for one another. I am proud to live in Fairfield County and be your commissioner. Have a beautiful day and God bless America Fairfield County, and God bless each one of you. Thank you.